Roger that. Don't go too fast, and watch out for radiation. Over. Roger that. I still can't believe this. We're there. Do you get this? We're finally there. This has been our goal, not for weeks or months, but for 20 years. My whole life. And it was not spent in vain. Now I know it for a fact. Mama, look. Are we going to live here now? I don't know. Why? I don't like this place. It's creepy. Shh. Don't say that. Robert Colonel. It's getting really hot out here. Everyone, masks on! Passengers, get inside and button up tight! Yes, of course. Come on, Nastya. Change of plans! We're taking the rail car from here. Wait for our human and me. Roger that, How about me? You've been dreaming to get here for so long, and are now leaving me behind? <laughs> Am I your daughter or not? All right, come with us, or else I'll never hear the end of it. <laughs> A wise decision. Yermak, stop the engine! to the safe zone, and sit tight there. We do that right now! Stepan, you're in charge while I'm away. Sir, yes, sir! Great. Let's go! Damn, we've been down in this place. Where's the Moscow? Yeah, looks like it. You see that crater? Wonder what the yield was on that one. Looks like a hundred to me. Lucky. The R guys used to have three and five hundred ones too. Well, even a hundred seems to have done okay. Artyom was right. People were coming here from all over the country. Yes, they were. Nobody came from Moscow, though. Until now. So much time wasted. We'll make up for that now. Well, we're almost there. Oh, no, 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 this is a bad place, no, we shouldn't have come here, really. Okay, so where's my welcoming committee in red carpet? I don't get this. Oh, see, nobody home. How about we go back, huh? Wait, look. Look. Identify yourself. Colonel Miller, here to report to the Minister of Defense. And where are your people, Colonel? With the train. It's dangerous outside. Contact them and tell them to take the train into the main airlock for decontamination. Welcome to the Ark, Colonel. Proceed through the tunnel and take the elevator. You'll be met inside. See? We're expected. Never like going underground, but this place, you know, this is completely creeping me out. Why is it so deserted here? No gun emplacements, no patrols, not even lookouts. Why would they need any of that? A nuclear warhead couldn't take it out. Yeah, this place 
this could use some cleaning, at the very least. Sam, idiot! You know what? Ain't no need for us all to crowd the government, so you two better stay with Christ. Yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. Speech. Reporting to the minister is no joke. Ah, get off my case. I pulled an old nighter. <laughs> Don't you feel like you should say something to Artyom now? Yes. You were right, Artyom. And I was wrong. Thanks for not giving up. Minister, Commander of the Joint Special Operations Forces, Squadron of the City of Moscow, Colonel Miller, reporting. I would like to request that my people are provided with temporary quarters and supplies, as there are women and children among us. Still, our fighters are in top shape and ready for action. Women and children? <laughs> Good. Haven't had those in a while. Who are you? Everything is going as planned. Everyone is fine. So far. <coughs> so far? I... I demand a, a meeting with the Minister of Defense, now! Do not worry. Everything will be just fine. And even better. The Minister and the Chief himself are expecting you for dinner. Dinner? What the hell? Are you fucking mocking me? Shut up! The doctor is talking. Where is the government answer? All here, Colonel. All here. We are the government you people deserve. Don't you dare, you fuck! You're just... You're just fucking cannibals! Calm down, you'll get jaundice like this. And believe me, nobody likes that bitter taste. The girl will have to wait, though. We must run the tests first. I don't like that cough of hers. Untie my hands, you motherfucker! And I'll shove those tests so far up your ass, you'll be spitting Watch them. your tone, young lady. Do as that young man does. He woke up long ago, but quietly listens to wise people talk. You fucker! Let me... Let me go! So, Colonel, now you will pick up the radio and tell the rest of your people on the train to come here. If you don't want her to suffer for a really long time before she is served. Do you understand? And here I was hoping for an intelligent conversation for a change. Alas. That's not a problem, though. 
since this nice young man will surely do it instead. He won't dare be contradictory once we're done with you. Well, nice meeting you and all. Yakov, you may start. I'll get you even after I'm dead. That may well happen, Colonel. I could choke on you or something. In the meantime, I'll excuse you myself. Come here, I'll rip you all apart. Every last one of you should have done that before the war. But I'll get you now. Burn this time to ashes. So long as it's full of life. Now we'll be full again. Good. Artyom! Remains! Here. Colonel, sir. I think that's Thank enough. Thank you, Sam. But it is not. We have to get them. But first, we must find Anna. I'm sorry. I went too far with that elevator. To hell with it! Idiot! Stop the main elevator! Ready! Elevator on the move! Sam. ETA! We One minute! Over. Yes, sir! Well done! Right between you. I got a thing for you here, you damn freaks. It left me. Just like our old D6. Even the lift is the same, exactly. True. And quite fortunate. This way, we can hope to find Anna. Still, the complex is huge. And we have ten minutes at the most. So, we'll have to split up. Sam, you check the filter room, the generator hall, and the storage. Idiot, you come with me to the command center. Artyom, you take the barracks and the sick bay. Let's go! Your floor, Artyom. 